Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Style Check. My name is C.L. Freeman, I'm happy to be with you today. And I'm also happy that I'm joined by Katrina Lee Jones. Hey, what's up? See, I'm happy you're here today too. Mm. Welcome back, welcome back. Glad to be back, coming into your homes, your mobile devices, wherever you may be watching us. This is Style Check. We're gonna start things off with what's trending. We're gonna jump over into international fashion. We've got some fashion tips at the very end you've got to stick around for. All of that is coming up and more right now on Style Check. Okay, so we're going to kick things off with what's trending. In our what's trending segment, we like to tell you exactly what's trending. <laughs> Surprise. <laughs> we also tell you whether we like it or not. That's pretty much how that goes. And yes. we tell you whether we like it using this check or this X. Y'all ready for this? Let's do it. First up, ooh, Jewel Metallics. Ooh. Jewel Metallics. Jewel this is going to get metallic. a check. Yes, for those of you who don't know anything jewel based or jewel metallic, jewel tones, uh, these typically are colors that are designed to mimic mm -hmm. jewels or birthstones, if you will. So this Burst is stones, if you will. emerald green and uh, some other stuff, turquoise or, uh, you know. Yeah, but you know how I feel about all that. We're not gonna have that conversation because <laughs> we had it before about these jewel tones. What? Anyway, I love check for metallics. Sure. This yeah. is getting a check for me. If jumpers were my friend, but this jumper might be my friend because it's a little wide yeah, yeah, at the bottom. Yeah. So I might can do that jumper, but I am saying yes. Yep. I love that skirt and I love that jumper, honey. That's a nice <laughs> jumper. I need to find that. I need to try that on. And ladies, I'll give you a quick tip. Just like on the men's side where satin is automatically, it automatically denotes formal. On the women's side, metallics can automatically be made formal. Mm. So any gown or dress or even jumpers, uh, if okay. you accessorize them the right way, if they're metallics, they'll automatically be looked at as formal. Free tip. Well, there. that's that's nice. <laughs> I can formal that. I can formalize that. There you yeah. go. I like it. <laughs> you like Next that up, number? ballerina flats. Ballerina flats. Oh, <laughs> I can't wait to see what you say about these. You ain't gotta wait. I have never <laughs> been a fan of these. <laughs> you don't got the weight, Craig. You don't got the weight. Listen, I'm not. I'm not a fan of them. I like for. I and I'm not. I'm like what I'm about to say before y'all start at. Don't at me because what I'm about to say, I also feel this way about men. Say I it. think when you come out of the house, you should dress. Mm -hmm. You should dress like you're going somewhere. And these ballerina flats never look like that to me. I feel the same way about men. I don't like men walking around in athletic shorts, white tube socks, and some Jordan slides. I'm just not a fan. I think, that's I think totally people different. should dress like they're going somewhere. And these ballerina flats never do it for uh, me. <clears throat> going to get I'm going to say yes. And the reason I'm saying yes is because sometimes you need to change out of your heels. Mm -hmm. So I'm not saying to get these to wear mm -hmm. with the entire look or anything like that, even mm -hmm. though I have some clients that like their little uh, flats. Mm -hmm. But I'm thinking, hey, these are a backup. Mm -hmm. You roll these, put them in your purse when your feet start hurting, because when you get a little older, honey, feet hurt, don't work. Listen, let me. Uh-uh. <laughs> don't work. No, feet hurt, don't so, work. But let me say this. I'm telling I don't, you. I don't even disagree with that. I just think there's still even a dressier way to dress down. Not if you want to roll them up and put it in your bag. Well, Especially that, when you live in the city, you can roll these up. You don't want to throw loafers and stuff like that in your bag. This is just more convenient where you can roll it, put it in your bag. If you're traveling or your feet hurt, you can take off your heels First of all, and still look only, halfway decent. only certain ones roll up. These Celine ones do not. You see the structure on these things? And they come with a dust bag as they are sitting on. So they don't plan on you rolling those up. And you don't want to roll those up. I'm just saying. We'll go back to that some other time. <laughs> Next look. <laughs> all right. Sheer pink. I said yes. Sheer pink. Mm -hmm. I like sheer pink. I mean, I'm not, I don't have to be a fan of this application. Uh, this is a little bit. Uh, I like it. 
And I usually like long and flowy, but they cinched it at the, not cinched it, but they gathered it at the it bottom. Gave you like a tear. Yeah, the now you the, have a problem with tears. It makes it up for me right there. But as a color, which is what we're judging, sheer pink, I like it. Yes, so we're judging the color. I'm and I'm saying yes. Location. Well, you're going to like it because it's pink. That's no, not always. It. Huh? <laughs> not I've always. never, and I mean never. And I don't usually use absolutes, folks, but I have seen never seen her dislike anything on this show that was either pink or green. I'm just saying. I don't know. Why, go catch the roster tapes. I don't, you won't find it. Next up, floral know. trench coat. Floral trench coat. Oh. Now, I typically like the floral trench coat. Uh huh. I don't like his. Now, it's just too many flowers on the thing. You don't like it? No, it's too many flowers. Too like many it. flowers. Especially in them, them pink counter It's too many flowers. I don't He's like it. He's a man, it's man. It's so much he so. Knows. I'm not, I'm okay with that. It's not a masculinity like conversation. It. I'm not, no, I don't have a problem with the masculinity of it or lack thereof. My problem is that it take, you cannot tell, you can't even see the buttons. You can't see where the coat even splits in the middle. That's a point. That, no, that, and I don't like it. So the design itself takes away from the, des the, the design of the coat. You can't see it. <sighs> Is it overlapping? Is it double breasted? Is it single breasted? Is it two button? Is it three button? You can't I tell any of that. Wallet. Where's the lapel on the jacket? Yes. You can't see any of that. Too much. It's about the florals. <clears throat> too much. <clears throat> yes. <laughs> I love it. Next up, corset skirt. Corset skirt. Now, if you can wear this, and I don't, you can add me on this. I don't care. If you can wear <laughs> this without looking six months pregnant, like, uh, wear it wear it if you're not there yet you're just not there yet that ain't me hating that ain't me body shaming if you're not there yet you're just not there yet you say certain things for the slim you girl? can't wear and if you got like a like like y'all call pudge. us you now why see see that's another thing that's another thing why when it's women we say pudge and when it's men we say gut like y'all don't mind saying we got a gut but we can't say y'all got a gut see what i'm talking I, about i don't think it's a problem oh yeah I don't think women have a problem with people saying good. Hey, y'all, uh, have, have the research. We're going to put that in the Instagram. I, I don't think, I don't think, we, sh we should ask on um, our Instagram. I don't think it's a problem. I think it's nice, and I'm I, I'm with you. If you are slim enough, I'm just going to say it, if you are slim enough to wear it, <laughs> I don't think this should be on a person that's really, really too hippie. Um, I think it should be one of those slim girls. If you can do it, do it. But if not, mm -mm, girl. <laughs> And lastly, in this uh, segment, slim crop pants. Slim crop pants. I'm saying yes, and I'm saying yes. We done renamed the cigarette pants. Y'all so wild. <laughs> <laughs> the fashion, listen, y'all, the fashion industry, we do the most of that. We be we renaming stuff. This is a cigarette pants with, which debuted early 70s, but I like it, though. It's cool. It's okay right. if they rename it. Yes, but it's okay. It's just a cigarette pants, slim crop I love pants. it. About it. <laughs> ah, YouTube, we got to get out of here. Thank you so much for joining us for the little time that we could show you. Uh, we do invite you to watch the rest of the show. Yes, and subscribe. Yes, and Mark is where we have where you have Comcast Xfinity. Uh, you can catch us on channel 1623. Yes. And I really think you should watch today's show. With Katrina and I even talk about her uses for wax. Candle oh wax. my goodness. And you know what? <laughs> Follow us on our social media. On our Facebook, like us at the style check and on instagram follow us at the style check and comments we like comments give yeah, it to us we do bye y'all you know, flats never look like that to me i feel the same way about men i don't like men walking around in athletic shorts white tube socks and some jordan slides i'm just not a fan i think, that's I think totally people different. should dress like they're going somewhere and these ballerina flats never do it for uh, me <clears throat> going to get i'm going to say yes and the reason i'm saying yes is because